I have squandered all chances to be it. Now I just have to do this really, really finicky final boss, who is a bit of an ass. Basically, the way you hit him is you have to... Ooh, nearly backed over the edge because I've got my hands on the keys wrong. You have to jump uh, over or around his head so that he swings for you and hits himself in the face. The only other way to hit him is to um, shoot ride a missile into him. He has two, uh, three attacks. He has a cannonball attack you've already seen. He has this glue gun attack that he's doing now that I am dodging so I don't really want to be hit by it. He will glue me in place and then jump and land on me. Uh, or shoot missiles. And all of those things are quite bad. Uh, and I'm probably dead, yeah. Unfortunately, uh, because of how the boss works, a lot of the times the ring is a bit useless. But uh, I guess we'll see. It's tricky. You can at least you can snag on his shoulder pads though and not take damage. But uh, hitting him pretty much anywhere else uh, is instant damage and usually death if he's in the middle. Uh, when he jumps and if he jumps and lands on you, actually, um, you can sometimes you can often survive if you're uh, not on the edge of a platform because he doesn't knock you forward; he usually knocks you backwards. Uh, three. Four, and now I have to run. Uh, you can hit him like this for the uh, first six hits, but after that you have to hit him with missiles. Um, and it controls much like Sonic does, it's just like, it's not bad, but it's a bit finicky. He's going to miss on me, or no, he's going to hit him. Now is he going to miss on me? Yep. Now I have to wait for him to come down somewhere. Uh, the way you let go of the missile is you uh, jump. Right, I think he he's going to yeah nuke the middle platform. So I hit him six times, so I have to keep... Oh dear, he lands. he's going to land, land on... Oh no, he's going to miss on me instead. I'm also not sure where he's going to land, so I'm going to... Oh, he went for my platform. He's going to start lasering me, or... No, missile. Oh dear. Unfortunately, yeah, well, after you hit him, he starts uh, glue gunning you while you're uh, moving in to hit him, which is really, really annoying. But it can, on the last hit, if you line up a hit uh, to hit him with a missile, even though he glue guns you, it can hit uh, before you hit the death lane and die. So you can sometimes hit him sneakily for the last hit. Hit 7 is usually the hard one. But most of the boss fight, you can hit him twice. Um, between attacks. I messed it up on the first hit. So uh, that's hit three now. Now I have to just dodge his awful blue gun attack. He's all just been on me. He doesn't shoot missiles until the third wave, I don't think. Okay. Four. Uh, missiles in a minute. Yep, oh, I was much too soon. Now where's he gone? He's probably going to land on my head. Yep. I think he's going to shoot missiles again. Maybe he'll shoot you. Ah, well, he's going to land on me now. So if I move, he should shoot missiles and then come back to the middle after this. I've lost count of the hits now as well. I think I'm on three. Missiles. Yep. Hit him when he's in the middle. Four. Cannonballs. It's much easier to control the missile, I've just found, when you uh, don't need to adjust your height to go for him. Five. Oh dear, I'm not sure where he's landing. Hopefully it's not on my head. I think it is going to be on my head. Yeah, I definitely think the right moment to move there. Yep. Now, this is kind of annoying to uh, dodge once he's taken the middle platform away because um, you have to move uh, 180 every now and then. Yeah, basically you have to keep 180 to uh, avoid it and it's a pain. He should miss on me now. Yep, now I can go to hit 7. I'll work out where he's going to land. Oh, 
it went over his head and then I got stuck, unfortunately. <sighs> Boss is a bit of a pain, but hopefully I'm going to do him. I have like, I've got 10 lives plus the continue, so I have plenty of lives, but hopefully it's not going to take like 13 lives worth of attempts because some of the attempts can really rack up time. Uh, I don't really want to have to make this video like 600 hours long. It's already probably quite long because of Egg Rock being the longest zone. But I guess we'll see. That's three. Four. Dodge. You can rack the hits up on him fairly fast, it's just the last two take a little while. So I really should have uh, gone for five. Five missiles. Yep. This will do nicely for hit six. Where are you going to land? There we go, six. And he's probably going to land. He's going to land back on that one. Oh no, no, he's going for that one. I better get over here ready to start dodging. Oh, I was much too slow. At least I shouldn't die if I'm lucky. No, he straight up completely missed me. Oh, oh, oh dude. <sighs> At least this next next attack should be just missiles. Try again. Over his head, but I'm on the edge of the platform, so he shouldn't damage me. And he's not actually even shot at me. What even? Now is he gonna do gun? Yep. Right, let's see if I can actually dodge him successfully this time. Well, I've been having fairly, fairly good success at uh, not dying so far. Oh, there we go. Gonna land on me, and then he'll shoot missiles again, probably. please. The boss, once you have his attack pattern down, it's simple to understand what to do, but actually doing it is uh, an entirely different matter. Right, let's see if I can just, just look at it. Oh, I hit him, but I, I was, I got glued off the stage. I hate this boss. I don't think he ever stops shooting either. I mean, he might stop shooting on hit 7. Uh, but on hit 8, he definitely doesn't stop shooting while you're riding missiles, uh, which is a bit of a pain. Right, two hits. Just gotta dodge some more balls. Right, I should be able to just, just go through him now. Okay. Three. Four. I remember the first time I, uh, I saw this boss, I was so lost for what to do on him because I couldn't work out how to hit him, or how to dodge him, or what the rhyme and reason was his attack pattern. But once you get down to it, it's actually quite simple. Um, oh, okay, wait, am I land? No, I'm dead. Great. I really do need to uh, try and sneak that fifth hit in before the missiles, because then I don't have to waste any extra time with his other attack pattern. One. Two. Jump around about six platforms for his cannonball attack to stop. So, four, five, six. There we go. Right. Three. Four. I'm to dodge lasers. Uh, well I say, I keep calling it a laser because it sounds cute, but it's more like a glue gun. Stop shooting on the next platform, I think. One. Five, now let's wait for the missile. Oh, I have to 
actually, fuck it, I guess. Great. Now where'd he go? Attack back in a bit. Hopefully it'll be more missiles and not uh, lasers and jump on me. Great. Well, technically I can land on it. I can use the middle as an escape. But I'd rather keep... Ah, I'd rather keep using all three so I can practice dodging. Ring. Right, this time he should use missiles. Yep. Right. And he's gonna land in the middle, which I really don't want. And I don't know which platform he's gonna land on, so hopefully it's not mine. Like he's gonna use the platform in the middle. That's right, six. Aiming now, he's gonna uh, glue gun. So I better stop moving. Yep. Oh, you dropped me. Really hate dodging this thing. I suppose, well, technically I could jump all the way across the arena, but I don't really fancy my chances. Uh, Sonic's con Sonic does control like he's in space, but he can breathe, which is nice. Right. There he is. There we go, hit seven, but I'm gluing off this fucking stage again. Jesus Christ. I dread to think how fucking many minutes this zone is so far of me losing to this boss. How many lives? I think I came in here with like, got to him with like 13 and I'm down to 7. Uh, average attempt is like 2 odd minutes, so Jesus Christ. I might actually cut some of those out. But then it would be horribly disruptive because I'm doing live commentary, so I guess I can't really. I also don't really want to have to restart the entire section because I actually got that Chaos Emerald. Oh, fuck. I don't fancy my chances of getting hit uh, again. Also, I got on the last try, which is almost impressive, so... Alright, let's see if I can just nuke him. I think he should be going back to the middle. I hit him, but I crashed him into him. Where's the ring gone? My ring is, I'm not allowed to have my ring, so I actually have to dodge everything now. Fucking fantastic. Oh, and that's it, dead. Great, gotta start over. Fantastic. <sighs> right, let's try that again without getting hit and losing my fucking ring this time. Well, what's screwing me up is uh, getting hit by the late glue gun, which is really irritating. Well, I think I might try and squeeze two hits per pass after the glue gun as well this time. Right, stop that. Yep. Three. Four. I'm gonna just start dodging now. Oh no. Oh, I have the worst itch on my nose as well now. Oh no, that's that. Oh no, wait, I'm alive. Missiles. Oh, Jesus. Yep, yeah, well, I got that now because I have to scratch my goddamn nose. This is the worst attempt. Well, actually, he might, if I'm lucky, just shoot me with missiles now. Rather than actually laser me. Luga mate, there we go. And because this is only hit five, he won't be too hard to hit, in theory. Oh, he's in the middle though, great. Yeah, that's six. Now it comes the actually difficult part of the boss. Please don't land on my head. Yes. I'm gonna stop dodging now. The problem is that even though it's um, technically easier to dodge, I still have to make a really sharp turn, so it's easy to get hit by the glue gun when I'm doing it. Although I guess it's not too much of an issue while I actually have a ring. Now I need to raise up a bit so I can spiral in on him. Where is he coming down? 
Oh, nope, I, uh... Oh, Jesus Christ, what did I even do there? I guess I hit the back of the wall and lost the missile shit. Really running low on life. I suppose I've still got the continue. I'm starting to run out of life, and that's really irritating me. Uh, I really don't want to have to do this, um... It's like a time attack video of me just finishing it off. Because I've done this once, so, you know, I should be able to do it again. I have the pattern down, it's just executing it. Three. Four. Good one. Should stop. Five. And... Six. Missile. Oh no, he's going to... Hopefully not land on my head, that would be unpleasant. Oh, he was going to land on my head, I'm so glad I moved. Now he's gonna start lasering. Oh no, no, he's missiles. Oh, Jesus, I should have stopped. Wasn't expecting that at all. Now he's gonna glue on me. Nope, couldn't dodge. At least that attack is mostly non-lethal though, if it hits you while you're on the platform, it just lands on you and you recollect your ring. This attack was the actually difficult one. There, okay, so he's on that platform. I'm just going to ride him out in the ass to see if he stops actually shooting the blue gun. Nope, I'm going to just get with him instead. Well, I did actually hit him with it, so you know, for what it counts, I can derp hit 8. I'm just suck at shoot dodging him during hit seven. Well, now I know how his how his attack button works. My so double hit each pass. I'm gonna try and get hit seven uh, quickly. So I am accidentally speedrunning this boss now to make up for the fucking lost time spent watching me be shit at it. I should be able to go through in a sec. Oh Jesus fuck! Well, speedrun abandoned because I am shit. That should have been like four hits now, five counting where he's come down, and six. Christ. And now he's gonna land in the middle and be really hard to hit with a goddamn missile. And I've lost my ring. I might as well just kill myself, to be honest. Yeah, in fact, I am actually going to kill myself. It's way faster than even trying to fucking bother with no rings. It would just be a waste of another minute or so. Right, one. Two. Thankfully, the hit detection for actually hitting him is quite small, but he does have spikes right over the top of his head, so... Oh, I'm wasting time now. Oh, Jesus, what? How did I even do that? Fuck's sake. <sighs> I'm getting worked up now, and it's making me shit at the entire thing. Right, six jumps on the platforms. Why, why didn't he stop shooting? Normally he stops after like two platforms. What the fuck is going on? Great, now I have to mess up the attack button. I should have been getting hits five and six now. Oh well. And I crashed into him like an idiot. He still got my ring back. That, oh well, no, maybe, maybe I am on hit six now. I don't even know. I'm not going to start dodging the advance. Am I over the platform? Yes, thank God. At least when um, he hits you by jumping on you, it doesn't uh, scatter your ring into the air like when he um, 
when you hit him using a missile. Alright then. Let's see if he has any stops. I know he won't during his eight, but it'll be kind of handy for this one. So if I can get him his eight, I can just crash it into it and not actually care. Nope, couldn't get close enough. Last life on this fucking uh, continues, so all my score is gonna go away if I don't get it now. He's not going to land on my head now because he's going to get rid of the platform. Genuinely considering not even trying to dodge, but probably should. Oh, there we go, that's that done. Missiles. Whoever told me he stopped shooting on his 7 is a horrible liar. And I'm off the edge of the platform again, but I'm so close. Right, give me my continue, please. <sighs> Last three goes. Although I'll have to uh, do it inside of time attack, because I don't really want to have to do all of Egg Rock. Or I guess I could do egg, redo Egg Rock and then just turn the recording on when I get to the end. But I will feel a bit cheaty if I do that. I've done each thing so far in one go recording, so... I oh know I lied, actually. I re had to redo Deep Sea, Deep sea because I sneezed and died right at the start. <laughs> Never mind. This boss, is, this boss is actually... Most of it is fairly simple, which is that last hit. Um, well, I say last hit. Last two hits. It's just it's so finicky the way he doesn't stop shooting. Right, that's six. And he's going to land on my head if I'm not careful with the looks of it. Now he should just shoot me with missiles. If I remember rightly, yep. Where are you gonna land? Oh, oh. And yes, yes. Right, I don't care that he's hit me. I think he should just shoot me with missiles. If he shoots me with a thingy and I have to dodge it first, that's, that'll be annoying, but I can deal with it. Missiles, yeah or nay? Yep. Right. Let's do I couldn't have done this on the last life, could I? What it was worth. Well, look, I do just gotta get nice and close. Angle it right. And there we go, he's down. Got him. And I didn't die in the process either. There we go, thank god for that. It's just unfortunate that all my score go not went away, because I would have had 300,000. So, that was Sonic Robo Blast 2. I'm going to be making a short video. Uh, I say short video, it'll probably be fairly lengthy actually, because the level is long and hard, uh, like certain other things, such as submarines. But, um, I'm making a couple of extra videos of the default Sonic Robo Blast 2 content, and then I will be making, starting on the, the Mystic Realm ones, which have some atrocious level design in once you get um, further into the game. But um, until then, we have some other things to look forward to, like uh, Neo Aerial Garden Zone and the Sonic Robo Blast 1 remake, which is kind of fun and interesting to play with. But uh, until then, uh, enjoy these credits. Uh, I've earned them, I think. Ta ta for now.